skin. Is this on me? Yeah. Hey guys, I know it's been a hot minute since we last did a video. Um, how, how long has it been? Like, um, I think more than two months. More, more like two years. <laughs> Oh my god, I think it, it was, actually has No, it was years. summer between sophomore and junior year. Yeah, then it's been two years. So it's been a little bit. So we both have um, kind of like gotten older <laughs> in the past two years. Nicole um, has gotten glasses. Oh yeah, I have glasses now. Um, I also still have glasses. Yeah, it's just a life update. Grace still has glasses. Um, and so Ayana's in the bathroom. <laughs> Should I pause it? Yeah. Wait till I gotta get serious. <laughs> Now. Why are you asking that? <laughs> Why can't you answer the question? <laughs> it hasn't changed. It's not true. You got a haircut. No. Yeah. You got a haircut. Show, okay. show them your haircut. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's going on right now. Why can't I just ask my friend a question? What are you doing? Right now? <laughs> what do you mean? You have to. Yeah, like how have your friends changed? Like what's happening? <laughs> Why would you do that? So we're at the mall because we're experimenting with some summer to fall styles that are coming in this season. Summer to fall? Summer to fall. There's a difference between summer, fall, and summer to fall because you have to recognize that transition period. And a lot of people just ignore it. But that's wrong. Like, September, you can't wear fall clothes or summer clothes. You, you have to wear that's summer the whole point to of September. No. What about when it's 90 degrees outside? You're not going to wear a long sleeve <gasps> with shorts. You're going to wear a tank top. Wait, so can you tell me some of the biggest fashion flops that people make during okay. this time? Oh my goodness. <laughs> people wearing cool tones. You can get away with cool tones during the summer. But in the summer to fall transition, you can't. Because you have to be aware that fall still has that warm feeling to it. So like... Oh, so give us examples. Wearing? I'm looking for an example. <laughs> this? Way too cool for summer to fall. You can get away with this in fall, but for me personally, I would think it's trashy to try to pull this off. In the, <laughs> in the summer to fall transition period. I know what I'm doing, and I'm confident in the world, and I'm gonna become a CEO someday. And polka dots. Yeah, polka dots. Polka dots are very <laughs> confrontational. I feel like, like, <laughs> <laughs> like floral is very. Oh yeah, sure. I'll get a coffee for you. Please don't give me a raise. That's what floral just screams. So true. <laughs> what if it was like what? Do the different color florals have any differences? Yeah, so this pink floral means I am newly divorced and I'm trying to get out there in the world. But <laughs> twelve year olds wear floral. Yeah. Um we're not talking about twelve year olds right now, Ayana. If we were, we would be in the children's section, wouldn't we? Anyways, so for yellow floral, this screams, oh, I'm in my thirties, but you know, I still think that I can pull off being eighteen. Um, next we have, hmm, it's kind of orange floral. This is, I like to be trendy, but at the same time, I think that I'm original enough to be different. But it just doesn't work for me. That's what that means. Oh. Um, 
I think the best, most classic color that you can wear all seasons is black. Black is just a constant that will always be there for you whenever you have any trouble choosing what kind of outfit to wear. Do you have any other questions? We found another article of clothing worthy of discussion. Oh yes, so I think that this is an excellent piece to wear it during the summer to fall transition because you can wear it, you can wear it, to, you can wear it to work and still be considered professional in my opinion. That's just my point of view. So if I go went to work like this, I would be like, I feel really professional. But you also, but also. <laughs> <laughs> Say that again. She works at a grocery store. Okay. But also, it still looks like you can invite me for drinks after and to your house after. It just screams all of those vibes. Also, you could totally wear this on just a casual outing to do your errands, <coughs> like running to the bank. She as an example. wishes that she was tan from Queer Eye, but actually, she's just bought me. Wait, so I don't know what that means. does that have anything to do with the summer to fall transition? Yes, black. And you can wear black anytime. That's such a cop out thing to say. Okay, okay. It's not incorrect. <laughs> I think this is a very. This is perfect because it's black. This? Perfect. You know why? It's black. Actually, I don't really like this one. Oh my gosh. Why not? Tell me why. Well, I don't like this one because um, you don't know what you're doing, and so if you like something, that means it's wrong. But, um, anyways, <laughs> um, they're mixing two different patterns here. Like, what? first of all, this is like half floral, because it's like, the flower is not complete. It's just the shape of the flower. Have you and then you're mixing half floral with incorrect it's plaid. Just, it's the plaid strange. is it's wrong. It's strange. going it's the wrong strange. way. You can't mix half floral with upside down plaid. Um, what is upside down plaid? It's just stripes in all directions. <laughs> anyway, anyway, so now we've moved to this Alfani piece. I really like this because it, <laughs> because it really represents the flow of the summer to fall transition. Oh my god! So why aren't you okay with half? flowers because in the summer to fall transition it's actually called half there's floral. half it's like the flowers are half dying but they're not fully dead because it's not fully fall there's not really any flowers in the summertime that's a springtime um i guess she's right she got me there um i like this piece a lot i recommend this piece just because of the pops of red can you tell me what really... this pattern is called this pattern is called original <laughs> <laughs> And I really like this because the pops of red give it that like flare, you know, that you experience in the summertime, but also has the subtlety of the white stripe that you experience in the fall time. There you go, Charlotte Roos. Go to homecoming. Wait, she turned the wrong direction. Here's the thing, there's a couple of rules when you go to homecoming. Rule number one is don't, don't wear go to homecoming. Dress. No. <laughs> <laughs> Rule number one, don't wear a long dress. Why, do so that. why is that a rule? It, it's Are just you one of those rules. Yes. What's, give me a rule for what you do when you go to homecoming. Um, um, rule number two, don't have sex on the pants. Oh. You can't have the same dress as somebody else, especially if they're hotter than you. <gasps> what if you're hotter than them? What do you do? Then you definitely should get the same dress. Yeah, you should definitely get the same dress. Yeah. Okay. Rule well, number three is don't go with someone you don't want to go to because then you'll have a bad Ivy time. Park. Do you know what that means? What does that mean to it you? Means, personally. To me, to me personally, Ivy Park symbolizes the struggle that I've gone through in my life to get to where I am today. Do you know what Ivy Park is? <laughs> like, do you know who you're repping? Is it a person? Yeah, look right there. Oh, damn. <laughs> this is insane. Oh my god, is this the office? <laughs> <laughs> it represents your struggles through life. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> what would you about this one? I think that this dress If you had a choice between very, this and this, which would you pick? I think this one, because it's very all-American. 
and I thought you were against cool colors. But it's different when it's America. If you live in America, it's kind of your patriotic um, obligation to. But I don't get why you're so into blackness. What are you talking about? She knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> Let's play spin the bottle. Everybody put your head in. Whoever's head ends up on top has to, what do they have to do? Has to um, eat the lemon that slice that's in oh, your cup. I'm okay, going to ready? do that. Who is that? This is the top no, of the cup. No, you, you have to define that in the beginning. Do it again. It's kind I of said the top. You obviously know that that's the no, top. No, no, of the no. Cup. No. But like, you have to define. You it. have to eat the lemon. You have to define nope. the term. No, you, you definitely have to define are on top. You have to eat the lemon. I, I can't even get this out. Lemon Let's kills see. your teeth. Then why are you trying to kill my teeth? Wait, that was my idea. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, wait. What do I do? Don't eat the seeds. Can I take the seeds out? No, you gotta eat the seeds. No. I don't want to touch the lemon. You're gonna put it in your body, and you don't want to touch it. Yeah. That's what she said. What? Mm, that's what he said. But what? Maybe he, maybe he didn't. <coughs> what? Oh, it's so But this is watered down. That's not even fair. Actually, it's not that bad. Because Wait, I want to try. Water for an hour. It's time. I'm doing it. Yes! Oh my I told god! You. Okay, we're playing spin the phone. Whoever's head ends up on top has to do the dare, okay? This side is well, the what's top. the dare? Um, you have to eat a spoonful of ketchup with Wait, Tabasco sauce. That's on not it. even bad. You come up with one. No. Okay, okay ready, set, go. <laughs> oh no! Yes! yes. That was, no, it's just, just quick. Yeah, just one second. I'm out of water. I'll die. Yeah, I have, have water. Teaser. Take my water. I'll die. <laughs> just I do it. So badly don't want to do it. Just you, do it. you're the oh one who God. made this up. <gasps> no. <laughs> I... <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh my lips are. Are they red? Are they red? I think they've always been red. That's silly. <laughs> Put your head in. What's the dare? Put your head in. What's the dare? Okay. Nothing Yay. with food. Okay, fine. You have to run into the middle of the street and do a headstand. That's not possible. No, it's a targeted <laughs> dare. Yeah. Targeted I hope it who? lands on Grace. And you. Oh, I can't even. No, 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 no. Yeah. Oh, you just that. won that right at me. I Hello. guess Grace is going to be doing a headstand. No, Stay tuned. No, I'm, not, no, I'm not going to do a headstand. Jump in the middle of the street. Uh, go into the middle of the street dude, and look then at, do a look jump at how and then see the street. Oh, you know right the now. jumps that you do on your Instagram? Look at. You know do how you see? Instagram is always jumping? We oh, yeah, take we have a to take a picture in the middle of the street of her jumping. Yeah. I want to take a picture in the middle of the street. Alright, let's do it. Let's go.